Yo, what's up? This isn't what it looks like, I promise. Okay, it's exactly what it looks like, but Gymshark, we had their big uh, online event this weekend, so they sent me some crumble cookies, which are my absolute favorite. I've eaten 25% of that one, but it's okay because we got ourselves a hell of a workout today. Well, it's a challenge. It's a 300 body weight challenge. It's gonna pretty much consist of push-ups, air squats, and sit-ups. Should we just jump into it? Now that I have a belly full of cookies? Damn you, Gymshark. I love you and I hate you at the same time. Just like I love and hate you. No, I'm just kidding. I just love you, that's all. Don't think, don't think about it like that. It's not weird. It's not weird at all, man. Welcome to the vlog. All right guys, this has to be one of the easiest but most effective workouts that you can do anywhere. All it takes is body weight. So it's 300 reps, 100 reps of air squats, 100 reps of push-ups, and 100 reps of sit-ups. Now they could be done using any number of combinations. So you can do 10 push-ups, 20 air squats, 15 sit-ups. All you have to do is equal 100 of each. You can go back and forth. Just make sure you keep track of them. Now, I first saw this on Men's Health, so I wanna give them a quick shout out. I'm gonna be tracking it all on my Whoop. So my Whoop is gonna be something that I wear every single day. I've been wearing it for about the last month. Basically tells me my strain rate, which is probably something new to you. My daily goal, I have a daily strain goal that I try to hit. So something like this is something you can do in the morning when you wake up to get that number elevated. It also keeps track of my sleep, my REM, all the good things letting me know when I'm recovered so when I can really push hard and when I need to back it off. So we're gonna be screen grabbing my heart rate during this. I wanna see how high my heart rate gets in this period of time. So I'm about 225 pounds, so moving through this quickly, it's gonna be pretty demanding, not only cardiovascularly, but also with muscular endurance. So depending on how you break it up, you don't wanna ever, I think, fatigue to the point where you have to stop. You know, I'm gonna to try to make sure that I have enough in my tank that I can finish my number of reps and then jump up to the next movement. So the idea is you never wanna be just sitting there resting. You always wanna be moving, and if you're 230 pounds, we're gonna see what my strain gets to and also what my heart rate gets to. So this workout is basically gonna be an air squat, which only stipulation is you have to hit 90 degrees. This is not 90 and you don't have to go all the way down here. So 90 degrees. Uh, on push-ups, you have to hit your chest. You don't have to hand release, but you have to hit your chest. And then on sit-ups, you gotta be here. Elbows actually have to come touch here. You don't have to touch your head on the way back. Back needs to touch. That is how the men's health video instructed it, so that's why I'm going with it. It's not a CrossFit workout or anything like that, so a little bit different no reps on this. You know, we might have hand release push-ups if we were doing it differently. The reason I'm doing it this way is because that's how it was done on the challenge that I saw. So we're just gonna jump right into it. I might need to do a little bit of stretching. That cookie's still rumbling, so if this gets real hard, I might be running off to the bathroom. I think the guy did it in five minutes and 37 seconds. I gotta try to go under that, which is gonna be difficult. All right. Oh. Boomer. All right, we got a screen <laughs> recording of my heart rate here. Must be a little bit nervous. It says my heart rate right now is 96. So, Rest um, hot right yeah, 96? that's what it says. So, here we go. 20, 20, 20. That's what I'm going to be shooting for here to hit 300. So that's basically five sets. Will put me at 100 each. 100 times three, 300. Here we go. Three, two.
heart rate at 155. Oh. Damn, I don't think I did it this fast. Got my ass kicked on that. Thanks, babe. You wanna give it a go? No, I'm good. I just trained my whole session. A strain of 4.6. If I'm shooting for an 11, 4.6 in six minutes is pretty insane. We're gonna be doing that again. I like these challenges. We're gonna have to do the military one again. I better start running. But that's it for today's video. Give it a go, challenge yourself. Tag me below what your score is. Yeah, we'll do this again or something similar in a few months.